What up, coconuts? So first of all, for those of you who are new here, we're gonna give you a moment of silence to subscribe to our channel. Period. So for today's video, if you cannot already tell, we're going to be decorating some Halloween festive cookies. So we have some cookies here that's already been pre-made by us. Period. From, the, from scratch, from, from scratch. scratch. So scratch. round of applause for that. If you guys want to see us decorate some cookies and spill that Halloween tea, keep on watching! Hey. So some of the cookies we made, um, we actually found some cookie cutters and we had uh, witches, cats, bats, and some we made noise. Some circles. <laughs> even, even our icing is homemade, but honestly... Let's just see how this goes, big sister. <laughs> okay, what are you guys decorating first? I'm decorating the moon. I'm decorating the circle because there's a lot of space. I'm decorating the batch because, you know, it's easy. <laughs> so, guys. What's up? <laughs> uh, um, tell us about your favorite Halloween. Halloween is my favorite holiday. For <laughs> no, for real. And honestly, I think it stems from my childhood i've always been to halloween because my mom um every year she would let us dress up and let us go trick-or-treating and we have this tradition tradition where every night we would watch a halloween movie and we can eat like um you can eat <laughs> no no honestly like we can eat like one candy that we really want to eat. Bullshit, boy! No, all you want candy for her? Yeah. <laughs> My favorite Halloween, mm -hmm. I think it would have to be when I went to that uh, that um uh haunted house that was hosted by some church. So ironic, but it was hosted. Church. It was hosted by a church, and it was so scary. Ah! Victory Chapel, shout out to Victory Chapel. Mm. <laughs> But yeah, that was such a good, um, uh, what is it, haunted house. I was so shook. And I remember people coming out crying, like full blown adults. A scary experience. I and mean, what happened that was scary? Man, the whole thing was scary. They even had us crawling in a tunnel. My fat ass was crawling in a tunnel. Daddy pig. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to get out. I remember my sister was so scared because in the tunnel there were like hands, like people were putting their hands through the holes. And like my sister grabbed one of the hands and she like crushed it. And I heard a person say, ow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> <She left. laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> what about you, babe? What's your favorite Halloween experience? Um, there were so many experiences that I've had where it just made me feel a certain way. I really like, you know, like the fall season because I just feel like it just, it just makes you feel a certain way, but mm -hmm. I guess the most um, memorable one would have to be Halloween um, when I was really young. In the oh, third grade! Oh, wow. In the third grade, I remember at school... Who you kiss? <laughs> <laughs> no, but um, I remember um, at school we had a haunted house and it was kind of like my first haunted house, I would say. and. Like I remember somebody came out crying and I'm like, what the hell? We just had to like go through uh, these tables in the classroom and I don't know if you guys remember, but like uh, there's these tables that are like crescent shaped. They would put it together and there's yes. a hole in the middle. Mm -hmm. So there was a person's head sticking out and I guess like your attention center like, holy shit, right? You were so young. And then somebody <laughs> grabbed somebody's foot under the table and then she came out crying and I was like, what the hell? But, you know, other than that, um, just coming home uh, from school on Halloween and then, like, oh my god, we're gonna go trick-or-treating, it's like, it's such a rush, you know, like, okay, we gotta go do this, but at the same time, it's like, we already know, like, you know, some places that we want to go to, and, oh, rush. and we'd still wear our costumes from school, so we come home so greasy and so oily. <laughs> greasy? <laughs> he and means greasy. crazy. Greasy. Oh shit. Greasy. Greasy, Greasy guys. Crusty. Awesome. Crusty. Man, my bad is so cute. No one could ever. Can I see? No one could ever. 
Period. I love it. Period, period. Wow. <laughs> so I finished my first design of the cookie. It's a circle cookie, and I just wanted to emulate the night sky on Halloween. So a little witchy, a little bitchy, and a little green pussy. So I'm gonna put this on the tray. I'm gonna try. Um, the next thing I'm gonna try and lose that. She's uh, pussy By the way, I'm so sorry if you guys see me licking my fingers. <laughs> I was trying to squeeze this and there's a fucking hole, so I'm just like trying to like manage that while trying to get it out of the actual tube. And plus, we're the only ones fucking gonna eat this and the cameraman. For real. Oh, so, so, if you're trying to get some cookies, you better come. It's like <laughs> 1 a.m. in the morning, it's a Saturday. What are you doing at Safe House? Somebody's offended. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, what's your what is your favorite like Halloween costume ever? Like what's the most favorite one you've ever worn? Mambo. I was always a kid with the fucking black cloth. No, but like <laughs> <laughs> No, but like in your like life, like you know your lifetime. In my life. Oh my god, my favorite one would have to be last year. What what what, what were you? Very good ballad. <laughs> Um, I scared a lot of children. That was so fun. Um, they were so scared to come to our. We, we did a trunk or treat um, on just on the street randomly, like with my family, and a lot of people. Surprisingly, a lot of people came, and but like a lot of kids were so scared to come to our. our what is it? Our car because it was because I was there. But <laughs> <Hello. Like, laughs> My grandma would always like buy my costumes. I think my favorite one would have to be Snow White. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Because like I, you know, like in my childhood, I fucking love Snow White. But it's just Palawan, so Snow White. <laughs> so grandma bought it, and I was like, period, Graham. <laughs> she knows the bag. She's like, I am your princess. <laughs> <laughs> I will be your princess. <laughs> well, for me, I would have to say it was. Sixth grade when mm -hmm. honestly I was just wearing a normal ass outfit and I wore I had this olive shirt I remember it was it had a skull on it so I'm like okay this is Halloweeny but I was what I loved about Halloween um that time was I was so obsessed with Lady Gaga For the Let game. Me go and so I made that iconic thunder on her eye. Oh, no. And I was just so proud of it that I did it for like two years. Like yeah. The year after, I was like, Lady yeah, Gaga. She said, I'm your biggest fan. Everybody better be jumping. <laughs> <laughs> I freaked out. What about a cameraman? Oh my god. Oh yeah, guys. If you don't know who a camera, cameraman is by now. Camera person. Camera person. Period. It yeah. is um, none other than Mr. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Miss Samantha Sabaline. Did you just say non binary? Boo, let her speak her truth. But guys, TBH. But guys, TBH. Well, that's cute. Never it's try me. her. Don't ever <laughs> ask, me, ask me if I'm an artist. Who Check said? my cookies. <laughs> Who said her? So Sam, what was your like favorite Halloween costume that you've ever mm. worn in your lifetime? Mm. My favorite Halloween costume would have to be when I was a black ninja. You were a black ninja? Boo, the real tea is I was supposed to be Mulan. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? <laughs> Hold on, I was supposed to be Mulan, mm -hmm. but then I saw my two brothers dressing up as ninjas. And I was like, oh bitch, I'm gonna be a ninja. Boom. Last minute, my mom goes, JD, you better switch costumes one time. <laughs> Boom, and he was fucking pissed because he's like, I don't wanna be Mulan, that's for girls. Boom. We went out and he was fucking Mulan, and I was the ninja. You're lying. And I go like the baddest bitch, but he still hasn't forgiven me to this day. Okay, someone here is an artist. <laughs> I'm just trying. Come on, please show. Please show them. <laughs> please this is a line, and I know it's Fred Friday versus who? Oh my god, it's Fred versus <laughs> This is the one where the knife is fully all the way in. That's why there's no silver <laughs> part that you see. By the way, do you, I just random thought, but do you guys remember like receiving candy that's 
like watermelon. It's watermelon um wrapper. Oh, that strawberry one. Yeah. yeah oh yeah, strawberry yes. wrapper. That was such. That was so like popular here during the time. Um, <laughs> but yeah. I know the house is rich when they give you chocolate, bitch. <laughs> That's when you know they got money. Branded chocolate. Branded. Hershey's special. Boom. But then when you go in, they have dynamite. Boom. <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> so what well, growing up as a child or during your childhood during your childhood which what was your most memorable like Halloween um, movie that you like watching? Halloween movie? Yeah. But it has to be like a, like a Freddy movie. What? As a child? Oh yeah, or Chucky, one of those. She said. For me, it would have to be the OG Mr. Casper. It wasn't scary to me, but it's like that it was hot. <laughs> no, that was that was the movie I remember. <laughs> That's the thing. That was the movie I remember growing up. Like I was really That's young, and I was watching Casper, and I'm like, okay, Casper, show me the ball. <laughs> Shout out to motherfucking Puss in Boots right here. Who was responsible for this cat? My, all I'm gonna say is check my cookies, girl. <laughs> check my cookies because untouchable, unfuckwithable, unclockable. Um, oh, oh, guys. Um, what about a scary experience that you had on a on a Halloween day? Well, for me, um, this wasn't scary, but to me it was, because it was when yeah. I was young again. It wasn't scary, but to me it was. What? What? Okay, go. This wasn't scary, but to me it was. Oh, I want to hear it. <laughs> um, again, third grade, or some other grade, I don't fucking know. We went um, trick-or-treating at Tontonville, and uh, I think I wrote a remember is, um, this house had a bush with like different masks on it mm -hmm. and I guess my auntie like she took it and I didn't know so then when we went to the car like I, was, I guess I was getting anxiety or I was already like over everything and then when I got in the car like she just turned like when I turned around she looked at me she like Rah! and she was wearing the mask and I got so pissed and I was like <laughs> just shouting I was so scared I was like <laughs> Honestly, I've never had any scary experiences with Halloween. It's, I guess that's why it's always been my favorite holiday. It's always fun. So I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've never had any scary experiences with Halloween. Okay, I had a scary experience. I mean, it was a stupid experience. But um, so one day I dressed up as a woman, <laughs> and I was full blown like a dress and um. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Um, heels. And I walked over to Sam's house in CK with my siblings, and we decided to take a walk at um, the what do you call it? Not the church. The church. The church. The what? The grave. It's not called the grave. <laughs> oh, the cemetery. Yeah. <laughs> at the grave. Sorry. About that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so uh, we decided to like, walk in the cemetery and man, the power just turned off. Like right when we were there and I was wearing heels. Yeah. <laughs> I was wearing heels. Boo, everyone ran. <laughs> man, I, I ran. I don't even know how I got out of there fast, but I got out and man, I was wearing heels. Oh, um, shh. Boy. <laughs> oh my god. And I think it was even scarier because Prior to that, like maybe a week or something before that, we went to um, the cemetery and we were standing there and we saw something move. Do you remember that? My bitch! That was so scary. scary like, that's really, that was really our like, uh, I know, so stupid. Sam's, so Sam's house in CK is like right next to the cemetery. Dude. So we would just walk there like at night. Like just for... Because we have nothing to do. Man, a bunch of stupid kids. Hey, 
Bebe. <laughs> I'm so glad this is our first video to introduce Halloween. Yeah. Um, I really hope that you guys have for the next few days because it's just, you know, a little taste of what we got. Something chill to start it off with. We don't want to shake the guys. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> What the hell? I would really thought. Guys, comment down below what is your most memorable Halloween. Comment yeah. because we want to know. Like, maybe you guys experience Halloween a different way than us, or you probably tried something that we haven't tried on mm -hmm. Halloween. Mm -hmm. So, comment down below, guys. We want to know. Have we ever spent Halloween together? <laughs> it all. Oh, like no, that's it. easy. That's like a question. Oh, us three? Yeah. Yes. No. When? Yes. The time I dressed up as Chucky. And you were no. You were Chucky. Oh yeah, he was Chucky. I was Tiffany, and you were um. Beetle. <laughs> Beetle Juice guys. Yeah, I remember we went to like PAC and they did. Oh, that's right. And, and Donovan won. And he won. Donovan won the contest. Oh! Okay, man, he was like barely. There's not even one, or you just turned one. Yeah. And he was just there on the ground, a little dino baby, yeah. and he was so he got the loudest thing. applause. He was the cutest baby in town. He was. He's still the cutest. Yes. Period. And also, um, I remember that year Halloween. Of course, a girl here did her makeup, so props to her. Yeah. We'll show a video, a video, a picture. We'll show a picture right here. So yeah, that was us. And then this is Lou. That's Lou. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, guys, we just love Halloween so much now because... Well, we love Halloween so much because I feel like it's a time of year where you can really express yourselves through different um, forms, I, I would say. Yeah. Like, we can express yourself any day, whatever, in your entire life, but... Halloween is just like oh, it's an excuse to dress free. Yeah, like what, what am I gonna dress up as? Like, am I gonna be a a pumpkin? <laughs> Why look at me and say pumpkin? <laughs> What's a pumpkin? It's right here. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Says the one who is moving the decorations. That is the last cookie. I'm gonna give a shout out. By the way, um, if you guys are wondering what kind of cookies uh, we make, these are sugar cookies, right? Mm -hmm. Sugar cookies. And I just uh, remember the little cat that we have here, um, one of our nephews, the Dylan. Dylan, one of our nephews, he was so cute. He really asked us if it was a Bronchiosaurus. Yeah. Bronchiosaurus, because the. The cat's tail like, looks like a long neck. Oh, good! Is that a brachiosaurus? <laughs> but it's really how he is! It's really how he talks! He's a cutie. <laughs> Unclockable again. Um, it's, a, it's a red striped uh, moon, a crescent moon, and my inspiration. Um, I don't know the inspiration guys, but she just said, do it, and I did it. She, Cheers! Oh, yes. 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 Mm. Yeah. Mm. Cheers! It's so good. I see the sprinkles. Guys, can I just say we, we had to just guess with the heating of the oven and how long we're supposed to um, we gotta Google some stuff, but we weren't sure about it. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. let's just take it. Remember, if you guys are looking for another cook cookie decorator, um, all we're gonna rock. say is check our receipts. <laughs> for real. <laughs> Period. We're out of cookies, and I guess we gotta go bake more, but. We hope that you guys like this video. We're not the best at baking cookies, first of all, but if you like them, stay tuned for the rest of Halloween. And if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until the next one, grind, grind on coconuts! coconuts. Oh, oh. <laughs>